Well, it's planted here, planted over there. So we'll just connect. And it's embedded. We'll pick it and slide it up as much as we can, and then we'll roll it when it's up there. You but do like that. I said, we'll get back to back, and like that will be, we'll have it right in. Well, once we see. split it, we could do the same thing that we were going to do with this, no? We could split it and then pretty much swing it over to the middle, upright it, and get it out of the way. Yeah, that's fine. Okay. So let's, let's get the tractor. Shine your light over here. They put hoses over their glad hands. So I guess it doesn't come off. Yeah. Let's throw, let's throw air on it. Yeah, let me disconnect there. Well, have you guys seen, uh, we have a, a tractor trailer here. Is the air off? Not yet? All right, let me go turn it off. And this guy climbed out of here. I don't see it. Oh, I see it. Got it? How do you climb out through the top? Put your foot right here. Put your foot right here and then get up. Well, I could jump. <laughs> Got it. Hello YouTube, we're here in the city of uh, Boron, California, uh, it's actually uh, Dave and I and uh, the Red Machine and uh, Big Flipper and we have this fully loaded uh, LNG uh, uh, tractor trailer that flipped over and uh, we're gonna basically upright it. Uh, our best scheme of attack here since uh, we have very limited space with only a two-lane highway here and avoid having to Flip this truck over on top of our truck with a limited space. We're actually gonna split it So we're basically gonna back up big flipper and back up um, the red machine Split the tractor separated from the container uh, with, with the tanker um, and upright one at a time so that way uh, we're pretty much working it here in the middle with uh, ample space and uh, with uh, with safety in mind obviously you're gonna turn around right yeah yeah back all the way up and turn around okay and then uh, we'll start working on this one once he gets out of here yeah okay <laughs> I think he did. I think what he did is that he was driving he and got too close to the edge and it rolled. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. It's not like he was flying. No, I don't think so. Well, the truck's not that bad. No. Uh, Obviously, going to rear tow this, right? Yeah. So, I think what happened is uh, as the driver was coming over, on this lane because you could see it's very very narrow it's obviously two lanes but it's very narrow look you could see where big flippers at uh, and how it's uh, very narrow so i think what happened is that he's uh, the driver was driving looks like the rear tandem's caught on the edge and all that weight pulled it over that's what i think um i don't think speed was a factor i think it's just the uh, the rear of the trailer just pretty much took it uh took it over very nice can worth. Yeah, obviously still salvageable. So let's get down here. Let me show you down here. What's that? A piece of can worth. We'll toss that in there. 
um, it's pretty much uh, how you could see it's a tanker that's uh, welded with uh, container pockets container pockets obviously would be uh, would be these on top uh, we disconnected the the airlines already uh, I climbed in there and pulled the pulled the, the, the emergency brake a parking brake on a on this tractor trailer combo uh, originally they were going to offload it but they decided to let us uh, upright it lo uh, loaded let's close that up methane refrigerated liquid so the fire department was here and uh, they deemed it was not leaking and I guess it's structurally safe and they took off cleared the scene and everything and they said uh, go ahead and work it you're fine okay <laughs> just like any of these I'm gonna check that the container pockets are locked which they are that one too okay Double we'll check these just in case. See if the pins on it. Yeah, there's a pin going through it. And that one I can't see, but the pin is all the way in. So when it comes to upright, the tank won't uh, separate from the chassis. So there's just simple checks like that that make all the difference in the world. Position my truck. Chucky up there since it's almost uh, October. Time to bring out Chucky. Hey Dave, when we pull the tractor, um, that rear is gonna come down. That what? That rear is gonna come down. Yeah. He yeah, has so what's holding it down is pretty much it wants to go up, but the weight of the of the tractor is holding it from from coming like this, you know. Um, I was thinking of grabbing the end and and just make putting it over here until it touches the side here. So by the time that we pull, it's even. Right? That way it doesn't slam and twist it. What, Chucky? You really saw Chucky? Oh, he's been there. We'll bring it over and put it pretty much on that ledge. So by the time that we slide this over, it'll be already embedded and it won't go anywhere. So you want to bring it over and just... I want to bring this over just a little bit just so it touches on that little edge right there. Right? Because yeah. if we pull that, this thing's going to go... Yeah, like that. <laughs> oh, look, that's holding it, huh? Got a little cable? Yeah. <laughs> Let me get a, a grommet sling. Here's this one. This one.
Hey Dave, I'm gonna start moving a little by little. You see how it starts sliding little by little. So the whole purpose of doing this, the weight of the tractor is holding up the, the tanker from basically doing this. Yeah, okay. So what I did is just grabbed it so that way all wheels are touching the, 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 ground. the ground. So when we pull it, it stays in a neutral without yeah. having to jerk it around and twist it. What kind of gym exercises do you do to do this job? Oh, <laughs> we, we, we lift weights over there just in case. It's like you have to <laughs> climb up there like it's nothing. <laughs> all right, I'm gonna drop it and then um, pretty much uh, rake to the rear. We'll pull it a little bit, we'll uh, pick it up, swing it, put it in the middle, and upright in the middle, okay? Okay. So I'm gonna leave these here, because I'm gonna use them. Uh, this one I probably won't use anymore. Maybe. Did it unhook or no? Huh? No. What do you need to do? I don't know if you should wrap up here or put the tractor back in. Oh, I see there's a gap at the bottom. Yeah. Uh, well, it would work if I pick this up. Uh, it'll close at the bottom. Okay. I'd have to pick this up. That's kind of far though. Um, yeah, from here, yeah. I was close to that and it was already floating the rear. Yeah. It is heavy. Um, unless I get close to it, right? I don't think that frame is strong enough to do it, right? Yeah. No, huh? No, it's too weak. Huh? Like this from here? Yeah. yeah, I'll bend that frame. Unless I pick up on the tractor. What do you think? Good With the frame now. hook? Yeah, see if... See how it's... Yeah. It's, uh, it's that way and this is that way. Mm -hmm. So we'd have to actually pull this this way.
Do we need to pull it back? We'll go up a little more. More? It does? One's going to the slide and one's going to the left. So we're going to put air, pull up air into it? Okay. Oh yeah, I see that. Okay. What if we just plumb air into it? Maybe the ignition has to be on? Okay. Right? You want me to climb up there, turn it on? You have good luck with this one, Paul. There it is. That's on. Yeah. <laughs> so I'm gonna put, try pulling it. Yeah. Hold on. Still locked. <laughs> Got it. It's unlocked? Yeah. So let me, let me just try to pull it up. Okay. Well, I hold the, the container right there, right? All right, got it. Let me uh, grab it from there before it goes over that way. The container? Yeah, we're clear. Yep. Let me go slowly, make sure it doesn't do anything funny. Good. Good. So there's uh, two tractor trailers on that side and two tractor trailers uh, on the opposite end. Apparently this is the only road that leads into the power, to their plant. So uh, now that we were able to separate the, the tanker from the, the tractor, I'm gonna put on my outriggers and move forward so these, these gentlemen can pass. He's not even moving. He turned on the truck already, but yeah, he's not even moving. No, he turned on the truck again, but this guy... Let's go, bro. Let's go. Let's go. Because they only go so, you're supposed to go 30 miles an hour. It says 367. <laughs> Look how close they drive to the edge. Then they wonder why they flip. Look it. Yep. Right? Yep. That's what happened to this guy, huh? Flipped it. <coughs> That's it. Yeah, he's coming. Oh, he's coming. Yeah, he's coming. 
Cool. That's it. All right. Yeah, huh? Are we good? I'll park in the middle again. I'll be quick. Yeah, let me, uh, let me put some tension on my lines. Let me know when you're ready. Right there? Okay, let me start flipping it then. Let me plant it so that way it doesn't fly towards your truck. Huh? <laughs> video game, video game. Yeah. Quad PlayStation. I don't need PlayStation. Yep. Or Xbox. So as you can see, we uh, uprighted the, the tractor. Um, we have to keep our putting our trucks away because um, like I said, mo this road is the only access point. Um, right now, obviously we have to turn this, uh, this tractor around so it could be towed since uh, the trailer will be staying here at this location in Boron. tankers and pretty much lift and lift and get it toward close to us and then roll it in the air I mean square up but they were our strongest but however you think if you think you could do it off that that corner they started lifting the outrigger here in the back on mine yeah but that's because you were doing yours just off the side like you weren't yeah right, I wasn't right square right here bro right here there shouldn't be no problem you know what I'm saying okay let's do it like that then you know what I'm saying? Okay, so two two part lift. Yeah. Just okay. Right there, That's fine. Bring it here. You know what I'm saying? Okay. Because you're already counting out my little baby truck. No, 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 no. If you want, if you don't want, just take it here back and I'll handle it, bro. <laughs> <laughs> <laughs>
I left your strap, my strap's there. Shackle? Yes, shackle and both are up there. Ready? You have it in the air ready? Oh, let me unclip this. Hold on. The ground wire. Let me get even with it. Got it? That's good. There. Well, you know what? Even if we get this one, it doesn't matter because we're going to flip it. Oh, yeah, it's about forty. Got a lot on it. Look at just a Mayan on this one on this corner right here. Oh. Nineteen thousand. Yo, you saw my truck just picked it up and nothing. Was <laughs> yeah. Cool. cool. All right. Rig for uh, rig yeah. for upright. Okay. Yeah. All right, look, going down. down. Yeah.
Hey, we're gonna barrel roll it, no? Yeah? Okay. You over you over your center? Is it swinging towards you? No, I said is it swinging towards you? Yeah, okay, let me get it. Right there? All right, let us stabilize. Let me know when I go up. All right, let's go up with that even. Let's get enough height. Are you starting to flip it over? Oh. This way? Oh, for the, they could pass? Yeah. Lower the landing gear.
Thank you. I see it. The plaster cover? Yeah. What's up, man? Um, just, they told me to, to let you know that I'm here. The, yeah. Yeah, no, no, take your time. No, I'm just saying. Like, oh, I thought you were rushing me, that's why. What happened? I thought you were rushing me. No, 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 no. I'm just saying. No. All right, thanks, man. Hey, Dave, you have my other shackle? Yeah, that one. This was come over here just to go to Long Beach every night or what? It's a drive, fool. They, they could only do what one a day I two yeah i would say two because by the time you, get, you sit here almost two hours and then by the time you get back you at night maybe food during the day is one fool. <laughs> he's on with the tractor Take 395? Yeah. It's easier or what? There it goes. Cool. Are you gonna are you gonna fork it? No? Maybe? Obviously you put straps here to secure the hood. That way it doesn't uh, fly off. Another strap here. Uh, chain to uh, hoist the, the axle. Chain binder for the tie downs in the chain. And obviously the forks. And the final piece is gonna be the, the light bar. Uh -huh. and, um all right guys, well Dave has already hooked up, put his safety chains on and has his light bar and he's gonna uh, tow it to Long Beach. Big flipper's done, so I'll pack up and go. All right guys, from Boron, peace.